Hello and welcome back to Lipstick, a channel dedicated to all things lipstick. Today we're going to be looking at the new Guerlain G Customizable Lipstick Collection as well as the new shades that they released for their mirrored cases. Let's just jump right into it. First, what you need to know is that there are three finishes in total for these lipsticks. There is a satin, a shimmer, and a matte finish. There are about 41 shades in total, but today we're going to be looking mainly at the matte collection since that is the one that just recently launched and that is what was sent to me in PR. First up, looking at the packaging, in the front you're going to see the Guerlain logo, backside of that you're going to be seeing the lipstick color itself, as well as on the top of the packaging, which you're also going to see the number of the lipstick, as well as a swatch of the shade. As soon as you remove it from the box, you'll notice that this lipstick does not come with an actual lipstick lid. It comes with a temporary piece of plastic that is meant to be removed. The entire Guerlain Rouge G collection is actually made so that it's entirely customizable. You buy the caps separately and they are about $21 Canadian. The lipsticks are about $38 Canadian and it does have a mirror inside. It is a little bit bigger than a typical lipstick, but considering that you have the mirror already integrated into the cap it's almost like you're saving space in your cosmetics bag without the lipstick on the cap doesn't stay closed it's not a magnetic closure so you do need to use the actual Guerlain lipstick in order to keep it closed so do keep that in mind if you're thinking that it might work with some of your other lipsticks because I don't think it will Jumping straight into the shades, this is number 61 and it is a matte bright pink. Shade number 80 is a matte dark wine. Shade number 44 is a matte orange and my personal favorite. Shade 27 is a matte orangey red. Shade 24 is a matte classic red. Shade number 17 is the only satin of the bunch and it is a really beautiful warm beige. Shade number 05 is probably super flattering for all skin tones and it is a matte rosy nude. Another favorite of mine is shade 04 and that is a matte warm nude. And finally shade 099 is a matte dark chocolate. And finally, there are five new releases for the Rouge G customizable lipstick cases and all of these I should mention are faux leather. Overall, I think the Rouge G customizable lipsticks are super fun. I love the fact that the mirror is already integrated into the case and that they're totally customizable and you can match the lipstick case with your personality. The lipstick shades themselves are super wearable and really flattering and I love that because not all companies do very flattering lipsticks. Check these out if you guys are looking for something new. These are definitely fun to play with. If you like this video, make sure that you give it a thumbs up and subscribe on the way out and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!